Hi, my name is Arlo. I'm the pint size pump. I'm in England in a little, tiny little town called Salford, right in between Bristol and Bath. My love of punk like, came from my mum and dad. Punk music is like loud guitar music with thumpy drums. I decided to start the zine because, let's face it, homeschooling was getting a bit boring and I was getting frustrated. But my mum also asked me what I wanted to write about and I wanted to write about music. The scene's about my like love of music and um, like, it's got puzzles, illustrations, interviews, comics and more junk and nonsense. The coolest person I've interviewed so far, that's a hard one, I've interviewed lots of cool people. Nice one Arlo. This is great, how are you going on? <laughs> I asked the artist questions on music as well as other topics. How old were you when you started playing guitar? I'd say around 10, maybe a bit younger, maybe eight. Banksy designed a t-shirt for your last event. Do you know his identity? No. He's like Father Christmas. What is the stinkiest gig you've ever played? <laughs> the bathrooms had burst upstairs. Marmite, yes or no? I don't mind it, but I'm not a fan. Yeah, I'm not a fan, no. Marmite is kind of like the English version of Vegemite. You either love it or you hate it. My dream interview for the magazine, Janelle Monin, Nadine Shah, up there. Robert Plant, maybe. Because I am a massive Led Zeppelin fan. It has been pretty hard trying to make this magazine. Like, the whole process has been hard. There have been some like, easy bits, like the interview, but like packaging it and like sending it out. But the zine has gone to lots of places. It's to Dubai, Sweden. Germany, USA, and of course, Australia. For me, like being a punk means like you do things other people wouldn't normally do. When I became the pint sized punk, I have got more confidence. My advice for other kids who like, want to make a zine just do what you want, don't take yourself seriously, have a laugh, make it fun.